Um, you know, Julian pointed something out real good after our last little video that it could look like this, this conference that's coming up on the 1st of Feb is just for leaders mm -hmm. of council state churches. And Julian was like, oh, we want to make sure people understand it's for everyone. Mm -hmm. uh, it's for, yeah. for, and I thought that was so helpful, Julian, to bring that up. Because mm -hmm. from my perspective, I think it can be quite discouraging for a lot of people in small council state churches. Yeah. Um, you know, resources are tight. Um, you're serving a lot because um, there aren't many people um, compared to the bigger churches. And then you've got friends who might go to the bigger churches, maybe in a city centre or something, and you're like, is it really worth me staying in my small council or state church mm -hmm. and, you, and, and stuff? And I, I, I think it's really important that we have a conference where everyone can come to it, you know, and, uh, and that, yeah. that in our church, it's like even the three of us, that the people who come to our churches our fellow church members that they know this is a conference that they can come to mm -hmm. that they can get encouraged that they can meet people in the same boat as them that they can be inspired and see what the bible says that will help encourage them for, for the long haul in their small yeah. council state churches mm. it was also if i remember rightly back back in the day uh, the conference was beginning to um uh, be a place where people in larger suburban churches who are looking over the border uh, at their council estate next door or nearby that they were looking to plant into or do some work into they were coming along to try and gain um, some wisdom hmm. um, and I think that's that's still absolutely relevant isn't it because those bigger churches are looking to do that sort of thing yeah. um, and certainly I can think of a couple who've come a, a cropper in the last five or six years doing that without any consultation. Mm. Um, you know, they've, they've planted into areas and that they've just not quite got a measure of what that will involve. Um, so I think it's a, it's a, it's a conference. It, it is a conference for a, a wider range is, yeah. of churches yeah. than just council estate churches. Right. And certainly leaders of those churches, if they're, or, or their leadership teams, if they're planning ahead mm. to come and, and, you know, ask some questions and, and gain some some wisdom maybe i think also like one of the things that I, i've noticed is when there's been really challenging times um sometimes yeah i can personally <clears throat> cope with the discouragement but i'm aware that people in the church aren't necessarily coping so well and in those difficult times it's you know trying to help the, and encourage the church is is the challenge yeah. isn't it? So, so the morale doesn't drop because that's really hard when the morale sort of evaporates from a church it's very difficult to to to, to then re-encourage people but um yeah. but i think you know i'm really hoping a good number come from our church because i think there's some things that we can share so that when we get to those times we're not trying to encourage them in the situation but perhaps reminding them about some things and, and I think yeah. also that the word encourage, uh, it's a great word, isn't it? It kind of means to give courage and give strength to. And that is really what people need, isn't it? In those times, we, they need to be able to, to be given strength. So, yeah, how do I get strength for this situation? Um, and uh, so, yeah, I'm excited about this. And I, and I do hope, you know, it's not just leaders because we all need encouragement. And, uh, and for a church to be encouraged, particularly at difficult times, is a great thing, isn't it? For a church to be encouraged when yeah. you're backed against the wall, so to find strength to keep going with faith is, is a great thing. So, yeah. Definitely. So so we're hoping that, that everyone will come along. And uh, I guess to, one thing to add to what's been said as well is that if you're a church leader that's coming along, please bring some people from your church along. Yeah. You know, um, and and you will get more out of the conference as well because on the journey home you'll be chatting to yeah. other people in your church about their perspective and we can learn a lot from one another so so what we're saying is this conference is for is for anyone who's interested in estate ministry it is for 
church planters, it is for church leaders, but it's also very importantly for members of churches who are on council estates or who are thinking about trying to reach out to their local council estate. It's for people who might feel like, well, what can I, how can I ever help on my council estate church? It's exactly for you, you know, and, and we just want to have a whole bunch of people come to this conference and get encouraged uh, for council estate ministry. So really hoping that you can make it on the 1st of Feb, uh, in London at London City Mission headquarters and we're really looking forward to having a day of encouragement and meeting new people building friendships with one another uh, all for God's glory Amen. So, God bless Fantastic. you all and hope to see you there <clears throat> brilliant blessing guys see you all bye bye see ya